Alright, welcome back. Part 2 of Super Mario 64. I'm gonna go fight Bowser. Yep. 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 I'm gonna remain on the first floor for a while after that, though. So don't worry about it. When do we get to the uh, the Haunted Mansion part? Uh, a few more stars in. You have to have a certain amount of stars to make the big boo appear in the hallway. I, th I think. I'm not sure how many it is, though. Oh, look, it's Peach! Oh, but no, no it's, it's Bowser! Bowser. Ah! And we're in Lego World. Actually, I thought that was so cool as a kid, just Bowser's laugh. Ho, 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 ho. Uh, Boo's laugh is just Bowser's laugh sped up. Oh, really? That's a fact. That's pretty cool. Shit. Damn. <gasps> Good job! Alright, first death. I meant to kick, but... Like that. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. Are those like stalagmites and stalactites in the background? I or think something? so. Like, I think you're supposed to be in a cave or something. Let's not do that again. I'm just gonna wait for that fire to go away. Yeah. And then I'll do this. Mario is so iconic, and I, I know some people are like, "Really? No shit!" But it's kind of weird how oh. I'm good. It's actually I just find it very weird how just a fucking dude with a fucking like big ass nose and red clothes and overalls just became like. Isn't he kind of a stereotype? Yeah. Is he a plumber stereotype or an Italian stereotype? Both. Well, we've Fuck. Hit, okay, we, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. We can't really say he's like a plumber. Well, he is a plumber. No, nah, he's a plumber. But that's canon. That's been, there's been so many things that he's been, though. Yeah. Construction worker. Uh, plumber. Um, what else? Uh, uh, I just can't think off boxing. the top of my head right now. Oh, yeah, referee. Yeah, referee. Boxing referee. So is Punch-Out technically a Mario game? Since he's in the game? Nah. Okay. I, I suppose uh, just... I'm gonna Easter give it to egg. Little Mac. Well, yeah, Little Mac's the main character, but... Get out of here. Just punch a mushroom in the face. Sometimes whenever I'm eating mushrooms, I just picture them being like Goombas. I mean... Hey... Just like eating pretzels. Apparently they're, uh, their name in Japanese. I can't think of, uh, what it is right off the top of my head. I think it's the same name as one of the monsters from Yu-Gi-Oh. It's the little, uh, it's a little furry ball with wings. You remember what I'm talking about? Karibo? Karibo? I think so. I think that's a Goomba's name in Japanese, and it means chestnut, I think. Alright. God! So long, gay bows. I'm usually not this bad. It's because I've you're... never seen the camera zoom out that far. It's because you're talking and playing at the same time. Yeah. That's what I'll keep telling myself, at least. Yeah. And I'm pressing the wrong buttons to throw in. And like I said... Well, like you said, I should say. Like you said, I should say! Uh-huh. What'd you say? What did I say? What'd you say was that you was not good with the Wii U controller. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's wonky. Here we go! I mean, I guess most people would argue that a Nintendo 64 controller is pretty weird to hold in your hand, but I'm used to it after 15 years, I guess. Yeah. Alright, uh... Is this beam of light here yet? Nope. How many stars do you need for the beam to activate? Not sure. So are the stars, like, sentient? I'm pretty sure. I'm like, pretty sure shine sprites are from uh, Mario Sunshine. I don't know if stars are, though. I can honestly say that the only uh, Mario game that I've played through entirely was uh, this one. 
Uh-huh. And that was a while ago. So I... <clears throat> I'm sorry, excuse me. So I barely remember anything. And, uh... I'm actually looking forward to, uh... At some point, you playing, like, Super Mario Galaxy. Yeah. <clears throat> that will be another thing that we play eventually. And you said you're gonna, like... Oh, there it is. It's ten stars. And you said that you're gonna play, uh, Super Mario World with me? Yeah. We're gonna do that multiplayer. Okay. I've never finished that game, so I don't know what to expect from, like, the last couple of levels. I just hear that it's really hard. Yeah. I mean, I've had a little bit of trouble with it. But I, uh... I feel like I might just be bad at that game, because, uh, my ten-year-old niece beat that game. Yeah, well, hmm. uh, yeah, I, I have to give her that. Yeah. Or, maybe not, I don't think she did it by herself, but her and her brothers, who are younger than her, uh, beat that game. Nah, it was all your niece. Yeah, it was yeah. your niece. We'll just go with that. There's, like, points whenever I just zone out while you're playing this. Uh-huh. And then I'll, like, come back to reality, and then I'll notice, like, la last time I looked at those stars was, like, you had eight stars, and now you're at 11. Yeah. Well, I just got two really easy ones. I hope I uh, don't mess this one up, because I always... I, I usually have trouble with this, this star. Might make it a little easier with the more... Uh... Precise controls. Yeah. Hopefully. And, like, my uh, N64 controllers are so fucking old. Like, the... the uh, uh, yeah, I messed up. The little knobs are, like, loose. I don't know how to say. Like, how, They just, like, flop around everywhere. <laughs> yeah. They're just all floppy. <laughs> Alright, hopefully I don't, uh... My wings don't run out while I'm over, and I just fall into oblivion. Oh, look! Ah, oh, damn. Uh, it doesn't count as a life, so that's good. Yeah. Gotta try that again. Man, I wouldn't even worry about lives. You got seven. Yeah. I mean, it's not like there's really any penalty for game over. Yeah. You know, that's the weird thing about uh, Mario 64, that there really is no penalty for getting a game over. The way I think they designed this game was, like, fun in the first place. Yeah. You know, and, like, anybody could play it, pretty much. Alright, that was a lot better. You've got the pattern down now. Alright, now... I'm gonna smash this button. Smash that like button, yo. I'm gonna... grab that star. And then we got 12 stars. 12 stars. Yep. Oh, guess what we can do now? What? We can go do Mario Wings to the Sky. Oh, on the first and level? And also, yeah, okay. get 100 coins in this level. It might take a little bit. Like, so. would you consider these levels or, like, stages? They call them courses. Courses, okay. Uh, we'll just go and with I, the official I, term. I would, uh... I would consider each stage or like each star a level even though you can get uh i'm sorry it's hard for me to play and talk at the same time even though you can uh get different stars depending on what stage you're on like i can go fight i can go to the level that says oh go fight king babam and uh and i can do chain chomp instead and no one's going to tell me anything about it. I like so, that aspect. I don't know. Yeah. You can mostly do it in any order. Yeah. But if you don't choose the uh, Babam one, you know, King Babam. You can't fight him because yeah. he's not up there. It's more like the stage based stars than you're talking about. Yeah. Like the stars that kind of already appear on the stage. Did I even. Yeah, I chose the right one, because there's the Koopa right here, and he gives me a blue coin. I always feel bad for killing him, because he, like, r runs away. I don't consider him to be, like, a bad guy. Give me that coin! Like I said... I need this. And if you can hear in the background, the people that live with me, they, uh... They're listening to, uh... The LSU Football. game right now. So, you might hear a few screams. Just wanted to let y'all know. Ooh, I wanna, uh... I wanna show you something. 
I don't know if you've ever seen this before. What is I, it? I gotta make another bomb spawn. What so gonna I'm, I'm gonna run down here. Be, be, be patient. Okay, fine. I'll shut the fuck up. <laughs> Th that's basically what you're telling me. Shut the fuck up, Steve. Just say it. <laughs> you bastard. I did not know about that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I gotta go down here and... Oh, whoops. Look at the ground! In this level, I just kind of get every possible coin, because they're very few scarce. And few and far between. Like, I, I, I'm I, trying to remember. Like, sorry, I'm so quiet. I'm just trying to remember, like, the last time I actually fully played oh, through this game. that was weird. Okay, I thought he was going to get me. It wouldn't really matter if he did anyway. What the fuck? <gasps> we'll, we'll tell that story at a later time. Whenever it's appropriate. We got a we got a few funny stories to tell y'all. So Whatever here here's a just a short story. I used to think you could do this in real life. You really thought you could do this in real? I know yeah. what you're talking about. Am I going the right way? Is it clockwise or counterclockwise? I don't know. Excuse me? I'm pretty sure it's in this. There it is. I don't know why that one didn't do it. Yeah, I used to, uh... Or... I, like, believed for, like, momentarily that I could do this. Because I started running around a tree one time. How old were you? I don't know. I was pretty young. Alright, here's an, here's an interesting question that I, I haven't actually learned of yet. So... What is the very first Nintendo game you remember playing? Either Mario Kart 64 or Super Mario World. All right, for the SNES. That's funny because I think the first uh, Nintendo game, like actually made by Nintendo, not like for the Nintendo 64 console, uh -huh. was actually uh, Mario Kart 64. Yeah. And uh, the first game that I actually played on the N64 console. And I was really young at the time, was uh, StarCraft. Oh, uh, yeah. I actually just found out this morning that StarCraft was actually on the Nintendo 64. And the only reason why I asked that question is because you asked me that question this morning. Oh, uh, yeah. That was... Okay, you said that was the first game you played on the Nintendo 64? Yeah, on the Nintendo Starcraft. 64. But the first you ever played was Mario Kart 64? Yeah. The, first, the first Nintendo game. Yeah, the first game by Nintendo. Yeah. And y and y'all won't believe like the very first video game I ever played was actually Doom. Either Doom or Diablo, because we had Doom for the PS One and Diablo for the PS One as well. It was, that's the, like the furthest back I remember playing video games. It might not have been the first game I played, but it's the only one that I remember. Now that I think about it, I can't remember if it was Mario Kart first, or uh, it might have actually been Frogger on the PlayStation. Frogger? Frogger. Hey, I won't argue with really Frogger. Really fun game. I, I, that game's like a huge part of my childhood. Just throwing that out there. And part of our adult life, too, whenever we're walking on like this uh, thing called the Trace, there's this certain part... Where it's like absolutely fucking terrifying to cross. Just across the highway. Around a curve where nobody can see uh, what's <laughs> what's ahead of them. Yeah, it's we call it the S-curve. And like, if you... I'm gonna die. Basically what happened right there. That's how much clearance you have. Like those uh, balls just going back and forth. You don't have, You have no idea what's coming around the corner. And people have no idea that you're going to be crossing the trace or not. And we usually walk the trace at night, which is doubly stupid. Yeah. Wearing black clothes. Yeah. <clears throat> and I don't know why we do that. And speaking of... It's almost time. Well, you know what? Let's just stop right here. Actually, do we have time for me to... Nah, we're running out of time. Alright, well... 